In this video, I want to quickly show you how to run system updates on your district computer. This is really important to do on a regular basis. Restarting your computer often isn't enough to catch the system updates that we push out to all users. So to find those, we would come down here to our search bar. And if you start typing in updates, you should see Windows updates um, to open up that window. Hopefully you will see you're up to date. Mine was last checked at 7.10 this morning. But if this is anything other than a few minutes before you watch this video, click check for updates and your system will go through and see if there are any updates that need to be pushed out to your computer. When that finishes, it might just prompt you to install those updates. It might also prompt you to uh, so here's an install now, um, and it might also prompt you to restart after those installations. And this is really important. Many of the problems that our technicians see can be solved by doing this check for updates. Again, this does not happen automatically just because you restarted your computer. Uh, this has to be done manually pretty regularly. I would say try to do this once a week, um, checking for those Windows updates. So again, we go to the uh, magnifying glass down here. Once you've done it one time, it's going to remember your search history. So you can come down here to Windows Update Settings, check for updates, and then either install those updates or install and possibly restart your computer. Please get used to doing this on a fairly regular basis. It's going to solve so many problems for you um, rather than having to put in a ticket and one of our technicians asking you to do this. All right, thanks, have a great day.